Hello dear users and guests of this channel, my name is Rodion and in this video I am going to show you how to share a report or dashboard from the report designer. First of all you should run the report designer and open a report or dashboard. For example, I will take this dashboard. The command for sharing is located on the file menu or on the ribbon tab in the design mode or the preview. Click the share button. You should save this dashboard in the Stimulsoft Cloud service. Please note that Stimulsoft can use only the interpretation calculation mode. The share editor contains a lot of settings to define behavior of the share dashboard. At first, you should select an access level. Select no access if you don't want to allow access by link. If you want to allow access to authorized users, you should select Team Access. And if you want to allow access for every user who follows the link, you should select Public Access. The end parameter defines a deadline for the link. Your share level will be set in no access level after a defined date. The result type parameter defines document type, which will be opened if a user follows the link. You can use the link to share, get embed code, QR code, or code to post this dashboard on Twitter or Facebook. Also, the link field contains controls such as copy link to clipboard, refresh to create a new link, open to follow the link. Click the save button in the share editor to save settings. After share settings are defined, open the link in your browser. As you can see, the dashboard is shown in the browser. And an advice for you, you can get a document for this dashboard. To do that, you should change the link for it. Add a slash at the end of your link and specify a supported document type. The dashboard support export to PDF, HTML, image, etc. You can change share settings whenever you want. It can be done from the report designer or cloud. In this tutorial we will change share settings in the Stimulsoft cloud. Open the cloudstimulsoft.com web address and log in if you aren't logged in yet. Select this dashboard and click the share button on the toolbar. For example, select no access level and save changes. Now reload the dashboard link. As you can see, I have restricted access to view the dashboard, but the dashboard link as web address is available. Thanks for watching. Follow the news on our social networks and subscribe to the video channel. If you still have any questions, leave your comments below or send us a request to support at Have a good one!